I think the first thing we thought about was who this child would be and what would be best for the child. And um, we wanted the parents to feel 100% this was their child. And we didn't want there to be a disconnect. We didn't, um, we wanted it to be whatever level they were willing to have it for us. So we were okay with it if we never heard a peep after the birth or if they wanted to share everything with us. Um, we were hoping to get um, a lot of information, I think. I think we wanted to stay tuned in to who this new human was going to be and um, what happened in her life. In working with the National Embryo Donation Center and how they were very clear with us on the process and hearing that it is, um, it's the same thing any adoptive parents would go through. I mean, it's a stringent process on that other, I can't imagine going through it personally. And, um, but digging in through every detail of the, the new parents' lives to make sure that it's the right fit and that um, this couple is ready to receive this immense responsibility in their life. So hearing about all of the, um, what all they had to go through just to get into this process um, and the background checks, it made me feel a lot more at ease because it, it was a consideration. It was a, wait a second, are, are we making the wrong decision here? How do we know we're not making the wrong decision? And the information that we received back from NEDC is what was the um, deciding factor for me. Getting to meet them face to face really put us at ease. We knew, as Tiffany said, on paper, everything looked great. And in a few email conversations, um, you know, something can be lost in, in that and in translation. And um, meeting them and interacting with them really puts everything at ease and it becomes, um, you know, just special friends. and. Um, you know, we, we have bonded on several other levels and commonalities that we have. Um, so, you know, it's interesting to be able to share this experience with them and, and for all of the kids to remain special friends and, and uh, you know, as they grow, grow older.